Hi, this is Freddy from Bizsprint, bringing you another new feature in Revit 2025. So this one is about being able to join two walls that are next to each other in a faster way. So typically when you have a wall condition like this, where you might have a stair that has a concrete wall enclosure, um, each level might have different finishes on it. So you want to address that as a separate wall. Uh, you are able to now join those walls together. So you can technically have this condition where those walls are working independently from each other. Um, but now when you draw a new wall, you have two new options, auto join, which is just going to join them together. It might be possible to still move them, but you'll get the error to unjoin mm -hmm. the geometry. And then auto join and lock. So that's gonna lock them together so they'll move independently. So let's start off with auto join. We'll draw that there. Now, if I try to move this one, you can see it didn't get locked there. Let's delete that one. Try auto join and lock. So now if I draw that. You can see there. They're going to move together as one. Uh, there's probably things above this that are moving. Um, but you can see there that I can now manage both of them as if they were one. The other thing to note is now that this is in place, I can also add a door to this and the door will cut both walls as you can see there. Pretty nice tool. Um, this is something that was always possible to join and lock, but it's a nice way to be able to do that all in once and have that as a default for all my walls from now on.